Hi everyone. Today we're going to move through a seated and standing yoga routine. I'm going to incorporate a piece of equipment for this class. I'm going to be using this um, elastic tubing band, but you could use instead, um, if you have a belt, you could use a belt, or if you have one of those yoga belts, that would be great here as well. So let's go ahead and get started. muscles in your face start to soften and relax. Relaxing the jaw. And then gradually start to even out your inhales and exhales. So we're going to apply a count to the breath. On your inhale, Even think of your yoga practice. 
practice as a way of practicing being the way that you want to operate in life, being calm, being centered, moving very consciously, breathing deeply, not getting too caught up in judgments in the past or the future. hands rest in our laps and let the eyes open. Inhale, slide your hands back towards your hips, tilt your pelvis forward, open your heart, reach the elbows behind you, gaze up, and exhale, tuck your toes around your neck. Inhale, cow spine, by that little back bend, your chest open, your arms exhale, around. And maybe you feel inspired to move stretching through your hips and your inner thigh. And now let's reverse the circle, take it in the other direction. And return to center, sitting up tall. Exhale with your spine long, hinge forward. So stopping if you feel like you have to round your back to go further. Um, stopping to keep the, the chest open in the head above the heart. You might sweep your right arm back and your left arm back, turning the palms towards the floor. And you can step to your legs to lower your arms. So now we're going to incorporate our tubing into this exercise. So if it's still behind you, just keep it there, but I want you to grab a hold of either side of it so that the palms are facing forward. Already, I want you to start to pull the arms away from one another to help open through the chest and front of the shoulder. Again, make sure that you're not flaring your ribs or popping your ribs forward, but drawing them in. And then exhale, hinge. Building good posture, it's really important to work on endurance, endurance of those postural muscles, especially the muscles of the upper back. And that's what we're doing here. And then sit up tall, release your arms, and release the tubing and the belt. Circle the shoulders out. And let's go ahead and walk the feet back in. I want you to bring the tubing around in front of you. And we're going to extend the right leg out long. Using your belt or your tubing as an arm extension. 
extension, go ahead and wrap uh, the bottom or the center of your tubing around the bottom of your foot. Holding on to either end of your tubing, feel the shoulder blades draw together so you're pulling back. Maybe you have a bend in your elbows. And then keep that tension as you pinch forward. So maybe in order to keep the tension, you need to walk your hands forward a little bit and again make that we're stretching and strengthening. Great multitaskers here. It's so, so important to, to work on building up those muscles that support good posture. And it just feels good to stand up tall, to move with muscular integrity. Unlasso your foot and we'll switch sides. So bring that right foot in. Now extend the left foot out long. Again, loop the center of your strap around the bottom of your foot. Bend your elbows and feel the shoulder blades draw together. Keeping that length and openness within. Exhale, hinge forward. Again, maybe you need to walk your hands a little further down and then pull back to create more tension. Stretching through the back of that left leg. And by drawing your toes in and the heel, pressing the heel out, you're deepening, deepening that stretch even more. And then sit up tall. Very good. Let's go ahead and carefully bring that foot in. Um, take the tubing off of the bottom of your foot. Let's bring the tubing behind us. All right, for this next part, you have the option to stand. So you can stand up however you'd like, or you can follow my cueing. On your inhale, we're going to reach the arms forward. And exhale, hinge forward, press through your heels, and straighten your legs. I'm going to go ahead and stand behind my chair and adjust my screen so that my head's in there, too. right arm lowers. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, both arms lift. Exhale, both arms lower. All right, let's go ahead and grab our elastic tubing again. That's our theme today. And we're going to bring the arms out front. And before you add tension and make a pulling apart motion, go ahead and walk your hands out a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. And then make that pulling apart motion. Feel the shoulder blades draw together behind you, engaging the muscles of the upper back. And exhale, side bend to the right, reaching that left arm up. Inhale, center. Exhale, side bend left, reaching the right arm up. Inhale, center. Exhale, release your arms, circle. Go ahead and walk our feet out wide. Exhale to turn your right toes to the right and your left heel to the left. Inhale those arms out front and then make that pulling apart motion. Exhale to slide your right hand forward um, over your right leg. You have the option to stay here or tilt that right arm down, stack the left. You to make that pulling apart motion. And again, if you don't want to use your strap here, of course you don't have to use it. Inhale back to center. Exhale your left arm down and your right arm up. Breathing in. Exhale, side bend to the left. Inhale back. 
half up to center, and exhale, arms down. Circle those shoulders out. Turn all ten toes to face the front. Angle both heels in and your toes out. This time, we're going to inhale, reach the arms overhead, make that pulling apart motion. And then exhale, bend your elbows as you bend your knees. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, pull apart and bend. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, bend. straighten your leg, exhale, arms down. Let's turn our right toes in, so the right heel points out, turn your left toes to the left, inhale, open the arms wide to a T, and exhale, slide that left arm forward or sideways over your left leg, stay here or stack that right arm up and the left arm down. Again, you can use, lose your tubing or your strap if you want to. Inhale, back up to center, and exhale, your right hand down, inhale, your left arm up, exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, arms open wide, and exhale, lower your arms, turn all ten toes to face the front. Now let's go ahead and step the feet back in, let your tubing rest in your chair, circle your hands out, circle the wrists. And then let's step to the right side of the chair and we'll work on our balance a little. Holding on with your left hand. Inhale, lift your left knee. And exhale, hinge forward, extend your leg behind you. Reach that right arm out to the side. See if you can square your hips. Inhale, lift. Exhale, hinge forward. Inhale, lift. And exhale your foot to the floor, keeping your feet parallel or crossing the right ankle over your left. Inhale, right arm lifts, exhale, side bend to the left. This is such a deep, wonderful side stretch. Exhale, lower your arm and uncross your legs. Let's switch sides, stepping over to the left side of your chair. Make sure you don't have anything in the way. Inhale, lift your right knee, find your center, and exhale, hinge forward, extend your leg behind you. So again, you can bring that left arm out to the side. See if you can square your hips towards the floor. Inhale, lift. Exhale, hinge forward. Inhale, Deep 
breath out. Inhale, hands to prayer, lift your left heel. Exhale, step it back. And bring your hands to your hips, squaring the shoulders and hips to the front. Maybe you find your imaginary tubing, or you can, you can grab a hold of it, make that pulling apart motion. And imagine that you're going to slide that right heel forward and feel that fire up the back of the right leg. Strong abdominals, connecting your ribs to your pubic bone, protecting your low back. Exhale, step your feet together, take a deep breath in, deep breath out. Let's do that one more time on each side. Inhale, hands to prayer, lift your right heel. Exhale, step that right foot back. Find your lunge. This time, let's bring our arms into cactus pose. So, elbows are bent at 90 degrees, palms are facing in, thumbs are sliding back. If you had that tubing, your palms would be facing forward, you'd be pulling apart. On your next exhale, lower your arms, step your feet together. Take a deep breath in through your nose, out through your mouth. Inhale, hands to prayer, lift your left heel. Exhale, step it back. Inhale, arms to cactus, bending the elbows, turning the palms to face forward or to face one another. The shoulder blades draw together behind you. It's time to take a seat in the chair again. Let's try this uh, very consciously. So line up in front of your chair. On your inhale, reach your arms forward and exhale, slowly lower the hips down and back. Very good. All right, we're going to start to cool it down for our final relaxation pose here. So again, let's cross the right ankle over the left. Inhale, sit up tall. And exhale, turn to the right. Inhale, center. And exhale, keep your right ankle low or lift it up high and hinge forward.
Reach your arms forward, interlace your hands around your back. Let the shoulder blades draw away from the back. Open your arms up wide and stretch through your chest. Long arms down. chair. Scoot forward or scoot back. And just like our asana practice or our movement-based practice, sitting still and quieting your mind and your body is also a practice that you can get better with at, or get better at with time. So let's go ahead and practice that. Settle, settling down into your chair. Go ahead and close your eyes. Feel the muscles in your face start to soften and relax. Allowing the jaw to feel heavy. Creating space between your upper teeth and your lower teeth. Before you open your eyes again, just take a moment to notice how you feel. Feel grateful for your body and all that it does. And thank yourself for taking time out of your day to move your body, to breathe deeply. self-care. And when you're ready, you can let the light back in and open your eyes. Thank you all so much for joining me today.
We're going to end our practice with one more deep breath. Let's take a deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. So the light in me sees and honors the same light in you. Namaste. Thank you all so much for joining me, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you.